on the drive here in hole number three option number one we are gonna push uh, here to try to get the ball as far down the fairway possible we do not want to use a win three ball as then we risk uh, being too short if we are being unlucky so we judge a win two ball to be absolutely perfect if you're gonna use any other ball we recommend you to use a win one ball if so but that's why we have multiply options so we in that case can um, uh, use different balls but again this is a tough one and we're gonna try our best to get ourselves the drop. Adjust max plus 20 P0, which one to one with a POC8. And then we're gonna push up, we're gonna push up based of wind angle. And then we do want to have a bounce that's gonna get us to approximately 500 to 510 yards. For the second shot, what we are going to do is to set two right spin and whatever top spin that the table calls for it all depends on what type of distance you have what we're looking for here now is to have the ball guideline to go one green square through the hole approximately if we are like too far or too short then we are going to set the position use the ball guideline as reference and then respin from there it is a bit finicky to find this type of position but the good part with this type of rough bomb is that it requires no wind angle tweaks as there is a slight sticky spot that we're playing into adjust is gonna be from plus three frame check we're playing 60 percent slider no elevation p3 numbers and we sent the ball to hit perfect And the ball will then clip the rough and you can see here that is room for greats on either side we roll down the green and dropping dead center for the albatross get our guides uh, using the free trial on patreon.com golfclashtommy for expert and master division